Memorial Day weekend in Las Vegas. Welcome back to the channel. I'm very excited for this event that we're about to walk into. It's a very special VIP NFT launch party for a new NFT platform called People Rain, which is founded by my good friend, George Chanos. Little story, two years ago when I was just starting as a little old podcaster, I invited George on to the podcast and this was before neither of us were in NFTs and I got to know him. And with this special event, he decided to host it at Starbase, which is an up and coming metaverse, VR, AR, interactive type experience, very similar to Area 15. If you've been out there and experienced that in Las Vegas. There's a lot of things going on here, which you can see I have these unique bills, which have Elon Musk and Mark Zuckerberg. There are these little weird niche crevices and interactive experiences that are happening. We have open bar, there, there's dancers, there's really high level people here. And I just wanna show you guys all the cool stuff that's happening out here in Las Vegas. As I said, Vegas is destined to become an NFT capital, not of the country, but of the entire world. And this is just the beginning. So let's go on in there and see what this is all about. <laughs> place of the dark web where they sold drugs, services, and pretty much anything else that was illegal. And so an ode to Bitcoin and Silk Road, they created this collection to kind of timestamp that iconic moment in Bitcoin's history. It's very dark past, and now that it's come to the light, this is a, a moment of crypto history that will never be forgot. George, first, congratulations. Thank you. And we're only an hour and a half in. I can barely walk around the place. So congratulations. Thank you. Um, everyone that's been on the channel has seen this incredible facility. But tell us a little bit about Pe People Rain. What exactly is it? Okay, so People Rain is a community of artists and collectors. And so what we're trying to do is we're trying to improve the opportunities for artists by creating a platform that they can show and sell their art on and then bringing them together with collectors who want their art or are interested in the NFT space. So the party that we're having tonight is our launch party and we've got some fabulous people here from all walks of life. We've got the creative community and we've got the collector community. And on Monday, we'll have our first launch of the Silk Road collection. And we're very excited about it. And from what I'm hearing, it's gonna be a sellout. Yeah, the, the gallery in there is fantastic. I've seen the Twitter accounts been building up to over 30,000 followers already. Silk Road, as you know, is a little bit of the dark past yeah. of, of crypto, but it, the, the art is giving it a little bit of an ode. Is there any idea of what's beyond Silk Road? Yeah, there, there are some fantastic things that are coming beyond Silk Road that are already under development, that are already in progress. Um, we're showing some additional art that's in the NFT room, um, but we're not showing some of the best things that we're coming out with because we want to be first to the space. And if we show it now, others, and we haven't minted it or haven't launched it, others could imitate. So we're kind of keeping that, you know, those cards close to the vest. Believe me when I tell you there's some incredible things coming. Yeah, I always want to keep some cards in the pocket. Yeah. We, we grabbed lunch the other day and you have, you have a very storied past. You, you work, are you chairman of Capriati V's, attorney general. You said that this is by far giving you some of the, the best feelings and some of the, the best morale uh, and purpose to anything you've ever done. Yeah. Uh, tell us a little bit about this journey over the last year that you've been doing building this. So, so most people that know me but don't know me well think of me as a lawyer and an attorney general. And the reality is, is that I began as an artist. So as a young man, I would paint, 
I do sculptural assemblage, I make jewelry. Um, creativity is a very strong side of my personality. Um, the analytical side is how I've made a living. And um, you know, serving as Attorney General was a great honor. Um, but this is an opportunity for me to plant some seeds on the blockchain that I think can grow into um, whatever their future might be, you know, whether they're, you know, small flowers, big bouquets, or giant oak trees. And so we're just gonna plant seeds and we're gonna promote and we're gonna build community and we're gonna see where it takes us. Every day I become more impressed with Las Vegas. Congratulations to George, People Rain, and everybody who's made this event possible. I'm very excited about the future of this platform. If you haven't, go and follow People Rain, check out their Silk Road platform, and we'll see you guys next time. Yeah.